welcome back everybody welcome back to the Morpha project and uh, today uh, we're gonna do uh, the part that we need to do so um, no further ado let's get started shall we so today I'm gonna be trying to do the second part of this drawing which is gonna be involving the uh, the the part right here so I'm gonna be getting more of the grass done so I'm gonna go uh, this one is gonna be the first one so we should definitely uh, Ah, alright, there you go, this is supposed to be in a different layer then, um, boo -doo 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 like that, alright, now what I'm going to be doing here is, um, Gonna put this also into a different layer because we need to have some quick groups here that need to be um, put together. Yeah. Like that, and then now we can get the next part up and running. So we need to close this up, we need a second one, and a new group. All right. Oop. So what we're going to do today is we're going to draw the second part of this. So we already drew the first one and we're going to draw now the second one and then the third one and then the So we're going to uh, get get all the stuff that we need. Um so First, we need to get to the right drawing part, which is this one right here. Then we need to switch to the right uh, line, so 3.6, there you go. And we can now put this out of the way. And we can now see like, ah, well, what do we need to draw? Well, we need to draw this one, so we're going to put this on to low schedule, so we can then see where we need to be anyway with this. Alright, so this one needs to be below the other one because it's gonna be in the grass part that we want to do. So, um, yeah. Let's get that on. So what I'm going to be doing here is actually figuring out like wh how and what and how much I want to uh, get called in or what I don't want to be called in. So do we want to have this to be on, on top of it or do we want to have that below it? It all depends on the situation really. So I probably want this to be below this so I should definitely put this underneath the uh, underneath the tree part. So this needs to be underneath the tree part because it's underneath the tree. So now we have that and now we can add the parts that we want. So um, we now have a decent line and now we need to add the parts that we need. So, um, the first we need to do is close this down because we don't want that. And now we can see like, ah, well, that works. Yes, that works all, that works perfectly. Now we need to draw like parts that we want to uh, succeed and making sure that it looks nice. So like for instance, right here, we can put something down like so. We can put something here down. All right, that will work. Get the size down. There you go. And now we can add the parts that we need. So what we're gonna do here is gonna be doing the same thing as we did before, which is just drawing the lines that we need. 
tiny bits of grass effect. And this will create the leaves that we want later on. So we're going to create the leaf effect now. Well, at least, you know, the effect that we want. I mean, this is going to be probably the last uh, part that needs to be done. Oh, wow. I have so much garbage of dust carrying up. All right, well, looks like I need to do my cleaning of my ha uh, room tomorrow. That's a thing that I need to do. It happens. There is no denying that, that things like that could happen. I mean, shouldn't have happened in the first place, but oh well. So, what is the best solution to, you know, doing this anyway? Is a very hard thing to say, because, you know, I have no expertise upon drawing trees. I know how to draw the part of the tree that is not part of leaves, so that's a thing, but the expertise on drawing the full tree is a difficult a difficult question indeed. But that's why, you know, we're doing this the old fashioned way. And the old fashioned way always says to uh, is always, you know, very nice towards such problems. Because as you can see, the more we do this oil, the more we add some, the more leaves we add to this drawing, the more this drawing is going to become uh, a satisfaction. Well, perfect. And that's more the word, right? Yeah, that's more the word. The more it will become perfect. And the more it will become perfect, the better it gets. So that's what we want. And of course, we don't want to have any, you know, loose ends that might cause the drawing to be not correct. And that's the thing that is indeed a problem. So, how do we make sure that this thing doesn't blow up in our face? Well, we designing it is by, you know, knowing that we can use the blur tool to create the desired effect that we want in the first place anyway. So yeah, I'm very happy about this. I'm also very happy that I finally did what I needed to do in the first place today. Which is of course buying a present for a friend of mine. Because I kind of, uh, you know, was like looking for something and then I was like, holy hell, this is expensive. So next time, when I try to do something like that, I... Uh, I know that I need to get myself a 3D printer again because needed to pay 40 bucks for 3D models is uh, a little bit expensive. Three models for three models for plotting them 40 dollars is way too much, if you ask me. Then I rather keep and use different models instead of you know paying that. So yeah, I'm very happy upon how far we are already with this drawing in the first place. Uh, I was a little bit, I was a little bit worried about how this drawing is going to be turning out to be. But the more I do work on this, the better it gets. The more I work on it, the more you know alive it becomes. Of course, you know, I still have some problems by you know shading, lighting, uh, color color palettes are not fully functional so I need to do some read uh, need to do some recoloring oh well that is just you know adding some darker and lighter po uh, parts into the color into the drawing and that can be all added later on so no worries there so yeah um, I'm very happy upon how far uh, how far we are at, th at this point and I believe, you know, eventually we will get this all done and sorted. Until then, you know, I am very happy to just work on this in the first place. Because it's very calming, it's very peaceful. It's not like, you know, there is anything that needs to be done. Like, for instance, Friday my nephew will come 
and then the day before that, Thursday, the uh, I need to prep myself to do stuff, and uh, yeah, I'm already very happy upon how much time I already have been spending on this thing. I believe now it's around 100, 160 almost. One is 160 hours for just this, just only the uh, lines and all that stuff. You can see that you know these drawings are taking quite a while because they're really, really, really slow drawn. But in the end, it pays off because yeah, yeah. because actually the. Um, Drawings are made with love, and uh, well, that that always works. And the more you treat with love, the better it gets. Of course, you need to be very critical of love, but uh, you also need to treat it like it is your baby. And that's the thing that I. Uh, I quite like about this drawing. Like that. So once this all, all of this, uh, once this whole, uh, whole thing is done, like, you know, the coloring we can then you know add this to the collection of leaves that we want to be representing in this drawing anyway there you go How nice this all looks, you know. I'm very fond of how this thing is working. Like that, boom. So the idea is that we're gonna fill this up. So, no need to worry. Yeah. Oh boy. Um, so yeah, it has been raining all day long. By the way, it's such a such annoyances because I needed to go to the I needed to go to the store and then you know rain showed up like hell and uh, nobody likes to be wet when home. So I actually had to change my uh, everything and that's up. Uh, very problematic because well you know then I was like well I do want to change but I also don't want to go on the shower right now so I waited until you know the evening eating and then I finally did the showering and uh, you know put on some better clothing but damn jeans don't don't uh they really don't like to uh, be wet because they take so long to get uh, such things to be uh, dried up. I know it would took long, but I didn't know that it would be taking that long. And that's the main problem. Alright. So... How much of this is actually quite good? I don't know. But we will see once the coloring is there. And today we're just going to be doing this part. So after being done with it, we're going to call it quits because that way, you know, we have the motivation of like, 
oh it ain't that hard or oh that that's if it is that easy then well you know I can do it a second time as well and why are we doing that because it creates the effect that I want to begin with it creates the idea of you know having uh, a valuable uh, well less uh, stressful environment And the funny thing here is that we actually can just add the parts that we want and add new parts in. All right, uh, now we can see if we want this or uh, this part right here doesn't make any sense. This feels odd. This 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 part right here feels odd. I don't like that. Now, since we have done that, we can now add color towards this and see how this is going to be working out. Because I want to see how this looks. That's, that's the first thing. So if, if we add this color towards it, which might, you know, lead to some other parts to be there. Now we need to figure out what does it, what does stand here that doesn't work. I believe it is this part right here need, that needs a rework because it's far too. Um, how do you say that? It's far too dark. Yes, that's the word. So this part right here needs to do a rework. This part, this part, and this part, and this part. that looks so much better so now that we have done that we can now add the color that we want so we're gonna add it the amount of where the color is supposed to be and then once we're done with that we can then finally get the other colors in It looks already it looks already decent, but you know we need we need to have less blend of effect. So we definitely should work on this a little bit. All right, just like that.
All right, that, will, that looks much better. Then since that we now have this, I can then add the effect of green towards it. So we're going to go for green. Then we want to have green, but then we don't want to have that green. We want to have darker green. And then we use this brush to increase the darker green. Then we can even put some more darker green in. Then we're going to put some lighter green in. So, right there. A little bit more light on the green. There you go. And then we add the merge blur tool to create the effect that we want like that and that will create the effect that I need yes but this tree looks horrible for this but and will be done let's take a look so if we only add this and then add the part that we need so if we add this it is true. It, it does give it uh, give the effect, but we need to have the effect be on the tree itself. Right, good to know. Good to know. Though this thing does look nice, so we're gonna give this thing a little bit of a uh, add filter mask blur. There you go. Now you can already see that yes, this blur tool works well. But we don't want this blur tool, we want this blur tool to be begin with. And we're gonna go casually. And just like that, I can do this. And then I need to go for the. Uh, wait, hold on. I believe I did a little bit too much. Pressing the button. I like pressing the button. There you go. And then we're going to use the blur tool to fix the stuff that we have. All right. Now we have done that. The tree looks very much better than before. Um, now is the question. Now is the big, big question. So I said we're just following up. We're just following these lines. All right. We're following this one, that one. And then we're going to add a new one right here that is big. It's like big. So why am I doing this is to see like where do I want and how do I want this. Because the more I do this, the better it gets. Yeah. Anyway. Um, allow me to just look it up. 24 minutes. Uh, no. No, no, no. This is, this is too complicated to do. Uh, to do to continue so tomorrow we will figure out this one right here we're gonna add it we're gonna add this one to it and then we're gonna edit the tree so that's what we're gonna do so tomorrow we will do that not today tomorrow because you know uh, it's a thing that uh, you know I need to make sure that I do this fresh and not uh, like right now all right um, I hope you all have enjoyed for today and uh, thanks all for watching. I hope you will I see you all next time. Until then, I wish you all a lovely day and uh, bye.